when you're making a cross out of an olive tree limb this is about an inch and a half then uh, you can cut the end off you know about a quarter inch wide and then shave the bark off with a sander and then I wrote on here John 316 with the soldering iron the pyrography one of these just use it to kind of burn burn John 316 on there pyrography soldering iron whatever heat heat gun anyway then you uh, can take you can slice down the side of this about two inches with your bandsaw and then you can make a, a slice that you can make a cross out of see I made this cross and engraved it for today's date and then I put a rare earth magnet in there glued it in put Jesus on this side put a rare earth magnet on the back side of this disc that I made for a base and you want to make the uh, poles of the magnets opposite then it'll stick on there see and then you can stick it on here like this swing it around to Jesus and John 316 line them up and uh, then if you want to put this on a refrigerator actually you can put this on a refrigerator flat surface I'll show you that let's assume this is your refrigerator see sticks on there good and then you can take the cross and put it in the base and that magnet on the bottom holds it up see holds it on and if you're a kind of a fidgeting kind of person you can take these magnets that are opposite polar polarized or opposite poles and stick on and you could if you're a fidgeter kind of person you can just fidget watch see or if you want to hold the cross and fidget the circle you can do that too and uh, there you go pretty cool made from this olive branch hope you enjoyed it and may you put Jesus on the throne of your life make him the Lord of your life this is about an inch and a half tall all right God bless you have a good day and have a good life